I'm gonna tell you 11 apps that all YouTubers must have, and we're starting right now. What is going on? My name is Nick, welcome to another video. If this is your first time here and you wanna learn how to grow your channel, make videos, and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by subscribing and clicking the bell so you don't miss anything. Okay, if you're a YouTuber, you need to watch this entire video. Now this list is my personal list of must have apps. These are the things that help me run my channel and help me get things done. So if you have something that you wanna add, definitely make sure that you leave it in the comments down below. Now, everything that is on this list is for a different task in the process. I'm talking editing videos, making thumbnails, managing content and so on. So let's start with number one, planning content. For planning and organizing content, I use Monday, which is something new to me that I'm obsessed with right now, and I use Evernote. Both of them are amazing because they give you like a checklist or they give you like progression as you go through different parts of the process when it comes to making videos. When it comes to making videos, it's important that you stay organized. It's important that you keep all of this stuff in order because if you don't, as things start to swell and as you get more busy and more busy and more busy with your channel, things get more difficult to manage. So the Monday app and the Evernote app can help you keep things in order. Number two is an app for video editing. If you wanna make videos on the go, Kinemaster is going to be the solution for you. You can add multiple tracks, you can add music, you can add graphics, all types of really cool stuff. Think of Kinemaster as the mobile version of professional editing software. The third item on this list, or items I should say, are all about making thumbnails, because as you know, as a content creator, making thumbnails is part of the job. Great solutions for making thumbnails on your phone are Canva, Pixel Lab, Pixel Mater. PixArt is something that is relatively new to me, but it is also a fantastic way to make thumbnails on your phone. Now, these apps are not Photoshop, of course, but they are a solution that's gonna help you make awesome thumbnails that can stand out here on YouTube because it's extremely important these days that you have amazing thumbnails. My brother D actually made an entire video on how to make thumbnails on your phone. I'll put a link to that right up here at the top of the screen. I'll also put a link to that video down in the description below because you definitely need to go watch that video when you're finished with this one because you need to see the rest of these apps. The next apps on this list are for community building. So if you are growing a channel here on YouTube and you have a lot of people that keep coming in and watching your videos and that are really digging your stuff, what you can do is you can actually create a community inside of one of these apps to where people can talk when your videos are not being published. The first on this list is Discord. It's awesome. We have a Nimanati Discord. You can join for free down in the description below. The second one is Slack, and the third is Telegram. All of these are fantastic. I recommend that you give them all a try. But I recommend that if you are a Discord user, of course, that you join the Nimanati Discord. Again, a link to that down below. Next up on this list, if you are on your phone and you're wanting to live stream and you're wanting to have amazing live stream, stuff that looks professional, just like you're doing it on a desktop, you need to be using the Streamlabs mobile app. It allows you to put chat on the screen, subscriber alerts, donation alerts, all that stuff that you see people doing on a desktop, you can do it on your phone. Next on the list, storage. If you are on your phone and you're recording videos, then you're gonna need a place to put those videos so that you don't clog up your phone. For these, personally, I recommend Google Drive or Dropbox, both of them are free up to a certain amount. So if you're just putting tons and tons of stuff up there, you might eventually have to upgrade, but even the free accounts, as long as you upload stuff there and then get rid of it once you're finished, can be fantastic solutions for you. The next app on this list is for keyword research to make sure that you can rank your videos and for video topic planning. For that, I use the TubeBuddy mobile app. TubeBuddy is amazing if you are on a phone or a desktop. It's the number one browser plugin for content creators. So if you're not using TubeBuddy yet, I've got a link down in the description below where you can go check out TubeBuddy. I recommend you do it right now. Wait, don't go down there yet. That link is still gonna be down there when this video is finished, but there's a few more apps that I wanna show you. Okay, if you're recording videos on your phone, this next app on the list is something that you really need to consider. It's called Filmic Pro and it helps you manually adjust everything with your camera. And the reason that this is an awesome app is because on your phone, the automatic settings typically suck. So using Filmic Pro lets you fine tune exactly what the image is gonna look like when you're recording your videos. Okay, so we've only got a few more until we get to number 11, which is one of my favorites. It's also something that I stumbled upon recently. But before we get to that, the next one on this list is for actually running your channel. If you are not using the YouTube Studio app yet, you're a YouTuber, you need to install the YouTube Studio app. It's gonna help you with your comments, it's gonna help you look at your stats, it's gonna help you manage your videos and all of that stuff on your phone. You can change thumbnails, all of it, right on your phone. It's made by YouTube for YouTubers, so make sure that you install the YouTube Studio app. 
Okay, the next one on this list is gonna save you a ton of time with comments. So yes, the YouTube Studio app lets you manage your comments. Yes, the TubeBuddy app lets you put in pre-canned responses, but this app that I'm getting ready to tell you about lets you add pre-canned responses directly into your actual keyboard on your phone. The app is called Pre-Tights Keyboard and it is awesome, especially if you have a lot of things that people always ask you about and you're always making the same responses or you wanna put links to specific playlists in there so you can send people to binge watch more of your content. Pre-Tights Keyboard is the solution for that. Next up on the list is Duet if you're on an iPhone and Space Desk if you are on an Android. Now. These are awesome. So if you are on a laptop and let's say you're traveling or you're just at a cafe or something like that and you wanna have an extended screen, let's say you're live streaming or something along those lines, you wanna have an extended screen on your tablet or on your phone, Duet and Space Desk both make that possible so that you can have an extended screen. So let's say that you're doing a live stream somewhere and you just wanna have an extra screen so you can keep an eye on chat or something, then you can use your phone or your tablet for that and then you would be on your desktop controlling the actual stream, which is pretty awesome. Now, if you're doing all this stuff on your phone, then of course, mobile solutions are what it is that you're looking for. So I'm gonna put a link right up here at the top of the screen. This is my brother's channel. He's actually gonna teach you how to master your mobile device and how to do all of this stuff on your phone. As a matter of fact, mobile content is the only content he puts out so that he can teach you how to do all of this stuff on your phone. So I recommend that you head over there and check him out. I'll also have a link to him down in the description below. And if you wanna learn more about growing your channel, making videos and all types of other YouTube related stuff, start now by hitting the round subscribe icon so you don't miss anything. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time.